Yo, what's going on guys? So nowadays when you play Path of Exile, there is uh, definitely quite a lot of tools that everyone is using. So things like Path of Building, Awakened POE Trade, uh, even Chaos uh, Recipe Enhancer is pretty popular. But lastly, I came across the uh, TFT extension, which actually I think is not used uh, that often. And to be honest, I think uh, definitely way more people should be using it. So in today's video, I want to show you how it works. So first of all, to download it, just go to Google, type TFT extension, and it's going to be like probably a first link to uh, download it. And then you are just going to have a window like this. So you can close it in here and turn it on. And it actually gives you quite a lot of uh, additional things for your trading experience. But in my opinion, probably the biggest and the best thing is when you go, for example, uh, here you want to buy for from for divine orbs you want to buy some stack decks or something and here when you're gonna be trading with people normally you're just gonna uh, whisper them and that's basically it but with this uh, tf tanks ex tft uh, extension you are going to have some warnings so for example here you see this uh, name is red and it says user stole items during service so basically uh, the way tft works is they have uh, like a big uh, moderating team and when uh, someone does something shady on uh, tr during the trade and someone provides proof that someone did something bad they uh, just not really ban him it's just uh, blacklisted so when you're gonna for example contact him you're gonna get a pop-up that he is blacklisted so he stole something from someone but you still if you choose so you can still trade with him like it is not uh, banning these people it's just giving you a uh, warnings some of them are red, some of them are yellow, like let's say this one. He only did price fixing, which to be honest is not that bad. This is why it is yellow. So again, it is up to you to decide if you still want to trade with him. And this is especially uh, nice to just find scammers. So when you're going to want to buy, let's say, a doctor card from someone and it is going to show you the pop-up uh, that that person scams someone, it's obviously higher chance that you're not going to get scammed. So this is the uh, best thing about this uh, tool in my opinion. But it also has some additional other options. So let's say uh, you want to buy doctor card. Mm. In here it is going to show you prices in let's say here in an exalt, here is in divine like 5.2 but you don't know like how many chaos is 5.2 so here it is actually going to show you what is the actual price so five divines and 0 0.2 exalts right now i mean divines is 32 chaos so this is basically is going to show you like this uh price after the uh comma so here you can actually choose this option so it is going to show you always or prices up to and you can choose uh, the amount basically here it has some additional options like hotkeys and so on you can actually go through these options to be honest i still haven't explored this uh, tool my uh, or extension uh, that well but another uh, good uh, thing you can do with this is here you have all of the prices so you don't have to just go and let's say you're uh, wondering how much is mirror right now you don't have to like go in here and uh, go for divines mirrors let's say if it is correct and it shows like 810 and 820 and here you can see it is around 820 right now so it shows you um, mostly correct prices of every single currency and here you can check and so on so this is also another uh, good info to have and the next thing is also uh, you can save your searches in here so you can create like a new folder you can name them you can create multiple of them in these certain categories so for example last league i created a lot of searches for my generous cry and this can save you a lot of time at the league start for example if you want certain cluster jewels and you know which ones you want you can just save the search and you just click and you have all of the things that you did put in here uh, saved up so let's say one day you want this cluster jewel, so you put all of these things and you look for one and you actually were unable to buy it. You go to sleep, next day you wake up and you are like, well, I have to search for it again. And you have to type all of these things. Maybe you search for multiple items, you have to open multiple search bars. So it is pretty annoying. This way you can just save all of them up and this is uh, what you can do. What to, Also what I like to do to have to not have like multiple of these, can also do something what I did here 
uh, let's say these are the sextants that I most of the time would buy. So you can save them up like here and then you can uh, just uh, antique one, go for this one. Uh, then if you want this one, you go like this and so on. So you don't have to have multiple uh, searches for each different sextant. You can just do it in here and you can actually do the same thing sort of cluster jewels and so on. But it is up to you how to do it. And obviously I'm going to set up some new ones for uh, the next uh, upcoming link. But if you are wondering if I'm going to uh, send them, like, can I share my own list? Well, first of all, I can't really share it because I don't even... Uh, like I haven't even made one yet and second of all I don't really want to share it to be honest because if I share it obviously uh, many many people will use the same as uh, I am and it is not going to help anyone uh, we are all going to fight for the same items so it is annoying and it doesn't take uh, too much time to just set it up uh, yourself so it's going to take you maybe like 15 hours half an hour if you have like POB you are going to know which items you want to buy so it shouldn't be that hard to set it up. But yeah, that's basically it. If you have your own additional uh, tips, if you are already using this extension, what other things you can do with it, obviously also feel free to leave the comments. But that's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching and see you next time.